Welcome to this week's e-newsletter. I'm Anthea Jamison, Assistant Principal of the Junior School here at Hazel Glen College. Last Friday, we had our official Ride to School Day, where we asked our junior school to use sustainable transport to get to school along the many safe bike paths that we have in our community. We had a fantastic response with 372 of our students either ride, skate or scoot to school and another 191 of our students who walked. That's just over half of our junior school students who took up the challenge. And what an enormous difference that this made to the traffic in our car parks and on our school roads. Well done to all who were able to ride to school and we hope that this is something that we are able to continue on a daily basis. Thank you very much to Mr. Jared McGough for all of his organisation on the day. On Tuesday the 21st, we celebrated Harmony Day. Harmony Day is a celebration of our cultural diversity, a day where we show respect to everybody who calls Australia home. It's a day where we celebrate with the students that Australia is a great place to live because of our cultural diversity. The message for Harmony Day is that everyone belongs and this message ties in beautifully with our college philosophy and the values that we live by every day at Hazel Glen. Teachers and students have been reading and sharing many books about what it means to be an Australian and we've all been involved in activities which are on display in our reception foyer. Students were also involved in an African drumming session which was lots of fun. A very big thank you to all of our staff and in particular to Tracy Lobert, Alicia Scott, Ruby Mitchell, Natasha Williams and Natasha Lambie for all of their work. You may have noticed some new garden beds in our Year 1 area and our prep area at the front of the staff car park. These have been developed through our exciting STEAM program led by Mr Lachlan MacDonald. Our students have been growing seedlings and will be using these garden beds to plant and grow beautiful veggies and herbs. We would like to thank Bunnings for donating over $1,500 of products, as well as sending five of their staff to provide manual labour in the rain. We're very thankful on behalf of our very excited students who can't wait to get their hands dirty. Our parent-teacher interviews are happening on Thursday the 30th of March. This is a variation to the school day, so students will not attend school. However, it is recommended that they do attend the interview with you. Bookings for the interview are open now through Compass. If you miss out on an interview time, please ring the teacher concern to make an alternative day and time. We look forward to the opportunity to share information about your child. On Friday the 31st of March, our last day of Term 1, we'll be having our annual Easter hat parade in the gym. Hopefully all students are busy at home creating something beautiful to wear. We'd love you to come up and watch the parade at 8.45am. I can't believe that we're nearing the end of term already. It's been a fantastic term with our new preps and our many new students settling in wonderful, wonderfully to our college. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank our, thank our amazing staff for the effort and the work that they put into everything that they do and for the great relationships that they've developed with their students. And I'd also like to say thank you to our parents for working with us as partners in their child's educational journey. I hope this continues to grow even stronger have a wonderful break with your children, a wonderful safe break with your children, and I look forward to what Term 2 brings. Thank you.